Hey everybody, Free Comic Book Day is coming up on Saturday, May 4th, 2019, right here at Stadium Comics at 10 a.m. sharp. And we felt it would be a mistake for us to not do an unboxing video where we show all the comics coming up for Free Comic Book Day. Uh, it's kind of been a tradition of ours over the uh, last several years. And who are we to say no to tradition? So we're putting the band back together one more time. <laughs> We're back for this limited engagement for free comic book day. How could we miss free comic book day, Ricky? Can't, you know. We've been doing it for so many years. Uh, even though Unboxing Wednesdays for now has ended, we felt it was necessary to come back and do this one episode for free comic book day, which is Saturday, May 4th, 2019. What have you been up to, man? Man, just like writing comics, working, you know... Ruling the world. Living the high life. Nice, nice. Yeah, that is. You got an update for people on like uh, what's going on with your book? Well, what, what stage of printing it's at? <laughs> we uh, printed for the March Comic Con. We did a uh, preview of Undergrowth. Is the new book. It was pretty awesome. Yeah. Can I put up some images? Yeah, yet? of course, man. Oh, it's all black and white though. Right now, color will be later. But. <laughs> It's good, man. It's all it features giant robots, so you can't go wrong. Giant robots. You can't go wrong. Um, yeah, it was really cool to see, um, you know, where it's at in the process of like its creation. You were very upfront about, uh, you know, it's kind of like half finished, right? Yeah, and some people picked it up. They're like, oh, it's only half a book. I'm no, like, no, that's up. cool. I was like, Look. that's cool. <laughs> Shows the process. Exactly, because so. the first, like the first, I think, I guess, three quarters of the book yeah. is pretty well all done, except for the colors. Uh, you know, aside from some details here and there, and then like the last few pages are really like rough thumbnail yeah, it's just type thumbnails things. Like blue. I thought it was awesome. Blew my mind. So what have we been up to here at Stadium Comics? Well, we've been uh, selling lots of stuff. Uh, packing stuff in boxes, mailing them out, repeat, 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 mm -hmm. over and over again. Nice. Uh, it's been very busy for us. But it's nice to come back here and do what we love to do in front of the camera, you know, in public. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Not that other stuff in Whoa. front of the camera. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, man, this is a free comic book day episode. I should tone it down a bit. We are happy to be back here to show you all of the free comics that are going to be a part of Free Comic Book Day 2019. Free Comic Book Day, of course, is our yearly festival uh, that's celebrated all over the world uh, in the world of comics retailing. And it's a day to celebrate comics as a visual and literal, as in the literal word, art form. Uh, we celebrate the awesome creators and publishers and people that bring comics to life. Uh, and we do that by giving away free books. There's thousands of free books that are going to be given away at our store and millions all over the world. Uh, lots of stores are doing uh, awesome events in their store. Our store obviously is no exception. As always, we bring it with the events. Uh, we've got some really great artists that are going to be showing up. Jamal Campbell, fresh off of his success with Naomi with yeah. DC Comics. And the announcing of that new book for, was it Vertigo? I yeah. Think? Yeah. Crazy, the guy's on fire, and um, uh, you know he also did our amazing Spider-Man uh, homage covers for issue number one and number seven. So we're really excited to have Jamal, Jamal back in the store. Uh, we're gonna have Marcus Toe here, awesome DC Marvel artist, most recently working on X-Men and also um, Nightwing for DC Comics. Uh, Adam Gorham, who is right now doing Punk Mambo for Valiant, but uh, before that, uh, his most recent book was uh, New Mutants. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, before that, uh, Rocket Raccoon. Uh, so we're really excited to have Adam here again. And we're also going to have Alex Milne here from Transformers. Paris Aline, who uh, teams with Alex Milne on our three uh, Marvel action IDW covers. Give me action pack. Oh man, there's so much going on. It's Jeez. crazy. Uh, and free comics and a huge store sale on top of all that. Ricky, enough about all of the cool stuff Stadium Comics is doing. Let's give people what they want. Let's show them the free comics. All right, first up we have from Arcana, Go Fish and Howard Lovecraft and the Kingdom of Madness. From Golden Apple Books, we've got Blastosaurus. From Titan Comics, we have Doctor Who the 13th Doctor, free comic book day edition. We've got Buffy the Vampire Slayer, Firefly, number one. A couple of Joss Whedon titles. From Dark Horse, we have Minecraft and also Incredibles 2. 
From Dynamite, we've got a preview of Vampirella, the new series that's starting soon. From NEC, we've got The Tick. From Chapter House, we've got a bit of Canadiana with Captain Canuck. And from Red 5 Comics, we have The Dark Age on one side and Afterburn on the other. Cool thing about Free Comic Book Day is you'll get a lot of publishers that will give you two uh, awesome uh, preview stories for, uh, I'll say the price of one, but it's free. But you'll get like these two-in-one books, which are really cool. Uh, we have Witch Hat Atelier. This is uh, from Kondasha Comics. Ooh, this one's cool from Dark Horse. Stranger Things, the comic. Ooh. Also features uh, Black Hammer 45 on the opposite side. <laughs> we all know I love Street Fighter. We got Street Fighter, Sakura, and Karen. This one's pretty cool. Can anyone do the laugh? Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> it was a Karen laugh, man. Don't... Yo, Kevin doesn't know, man. Kevin doesn't know. Uh, we have Joe, Joe Benitez, Lady Mechanica. Always love my Lady Mechanica. From Vertical Comics, you have Kino's Journey. So, my favorite thing is Monsters by Emil Ferris. This one is really cool. Looks like it's drawn in uh, pen and ink, which is really cool. This is Dragonfly and Dragonfly Man. Cool. Wolfie Monsters and the Big Bad Pizza Battle. If you have pizza involved, is it ever bad? Image Comics Deadly Class. And a fan favorite here, you got Lumberjanes free for free comic book day. From Paper Cuts, we've got Gilbert. If you're ever asking yourself, will soccer star Cristiano Ronaldo ever have his own comic book? The answer is yes. It is Cristiano Ronaldo's Striker Force. Free comic book day edition. And there you have it. Little Lulu, free comic book day edition. Animosity Tales, issue number one. Ghost Hog, issue number one. It should be pointed out, uh, again, I, I give this reminder every year, not every free comic book day title is for every reader. Often we'll have a good mix of kids' comic books, such as Ghost Hog, and more adult-flavored books. Uh, so just be careful when you're uh, going through all the free books on uh, Saturday, May 4th. You can check to see if there's a rating on the front of the book like Ghost Hog here has, or you can ask a staff member at the comic shop you're visiting on that day. We've got Starburns Presents, issue number two. There's four or five short stories in this book. Grumble vs. The Goon from Albatross Books. We've got Riverdale Season 3, untold stories from the world of the Riverdale TV show. A sheet story from Carousel Comics. We got uh, Zagor, the Alien Saga. Oh, kind of looks like Flash Thompson. Treasure Your British Comics presents the funny pages. You know it's going to be funny if it's British comics. Come on. Casper's Spooksville. Spooked already. The Overstreet Guide to Collecting. Check that out. Uh, fun fact, these dinosaurs here were um, Leonard Kirk's, one of Leonard Kirk's first uh, comics that he ever did. Kevin, you remember what it was called? It was like... Dino assassins or something? Dinosaurs for hire. Dinosaurs for hire. So, Leonard Kirk's, one of Leonard Kirk's first professional uh, credits there. We have Malika, Fire and Frost. This one's exciting. Interceptor by Dylan Burnett and Donnie Cates. This one's from Vault Comics. Uh, you might remember uh, Heavy Metal had produced the first Interceptor. This is a continuation, I believe. Blown up the charts, Source Point Press comes out with hope. Bob's Burgers, Disney's Descendants, this one's Dizzy's New Fortune. Antarctic Press is coming at us with Punchline. You know, I think this is the first time I've ever seen Bloodshot smile. Look at that, Bloodshot. He's just not a happy guy, you know? How can you be when your name is Bloodshot? Defend Comics. This is presented by the Comic Book Legal Defense Fund. Uh, Viz at us with My Hero Academia. Kevin, you ever watched this show? No, but I've heard really good things about it. I've never watched it either. Lucy and Andy, Neanderthal. This one should be a hit with the young kids. And we have Dear Justice League. Uh, this is a smaller format book. Uh, we've got H1 Ignition. H1 is a new imprint from Humanoids Comics. Uh, spearheaded by Mark Wade, John Cassidy, Yannick Paquette, and others. Uh, very interested to check this one out. We've got Robotech Event Horizon Chapter Zero 
From Scout Comics, we've got Midnight Sky. Uh, and also, Long Live Pro Wrestling. And Gut Ghost. <laughs> What's this? Image Comics with a free comic book day reprint of Spawn issue number one. And also promoting Spawn 300 coming your way in August 2019. From IDW and Disney, we have Star Wars Adventures. The cool Francesco Francavia, May the Fourth Be With You. Um, art on the back there. From IDW, we've got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Free Comic Book Day 2019 edition. From DC Comics, we've got an awesome preview of Under the Moon, a Catwoman tale by Lauren Miracle, and it's illustrated by Isaac Goodhart. This book looks really cool. Kind of reminds me of uh, uh, Darwin Cook's Parker uh, series with the, with the uh, single color artwork there. From Marvel, we've got the free comic book day Avengers book. and also has a preview of Savage Avengers inside. And this is a big one from Marvel Comics as well. It is Spider-Man's free comic book day edition. And this features the return of Carnage. It's Carnage. It's Spider-Man. It's Venom. Uh, it all starts here. This is the beginning of the new Venom storyline. Uh, people are definitely not going to want to miss this. All right, everybody, that is it for this free comic book day episode. Uh, it was nice. It was nice uh, getting back yeah. together again and showing off some books. Always have a good time doing this. Yeah. Maybe we'll do more in the future, in the near future, hopefully. Uh, but uh, it's going to be it for now. <laughs> we got a lot of stuff going on at the store over the next uh, couple months. And uh, it's going to be busy times. And I know you've got a lot going on, too. you got the Fold Literary Festival. That's right. You want to tell people a little bit about that? Yeah, so the Fold is the Festival of Literary Diversity. And it's probably one of the first festivals of its kind. There hasn't really been a festival or a literary festival that's featured, you know, very heavily or focused very heavily on diversity. So it's pretty exciting. we got a lot of cool things going on in Branton. we got um, some panels about publishing and about writing. Uh, of something that I'm running is called the Writers Hub, and it's like where all these publishers come, and they have seats, and they sit down, and then you accost them, this guy is. and you come up to them, and you're like, "I want to get published. How do I do that?" And then they talk to you about how to get published. So that's pretty exciting. Awesome, and yeah, we, you got uh, you're gonna be at Fan Expo this summer, so stay on the lookout for that. Um, any other shows you're gonna be uh, appearing at? Megacon, if you're going to Florida, I'll be there. Florida? Yeah. Dude. Whoa, my brother lives in Florida, so oh, I'm going to go oh. visit him. And I, I was like, you know what? As while I'm here, might as well. And lastly, Ricky, uh, you know, while we're on the Ricky promotion train here. Happily Ever After will be featured at PAMA in their art gallery. It's going to be on the what? walls of an art gallery. No way. I know, right? Crazy. When's that? That's in June sometime. All right, cool. So... Make sure you're following this guy on like Instagram to stay up to date with all those things. Uh, I'm going to be taking so many dates to the museum. I'll be like, check out. Just going to cycle people through. Look, yeah, yeah. At, look at my <laughs> book on the walls. Exactly. Ah, good, good move. Good move. Uh, all right. Thank you, everybody. I hope you're all able to make it out to Free Comic Book Day. Uh, anywhere in the world you are, of course, the best Free Comic Book Day happens right here at Stadium Comics. Hopefully, you can make it to our store. If you can't, well, then, what good are you? No, just joking. Uh, hope everybody uh, really enjoys the day. Hope you get lots of free comics, lots of awesome swag, lots of signatures, and uh, have a lot of fun, and let's just uh, all enjoy celebrating this wonderful thing that we have in our lives called comic books. Take care, everybody, and enjoy your free comic book day books.